If you got your iPod Shuffle 4th Gen from a loved one or want to give it away, you need to restore and hard reset the device. Now along with that, we are going to show you how to back up all music and then sync all in your iPod once again after the reset. So let's get going. For this video, we are using Windows 11, but this will work on Windows 10 or other versions as well. First, connect your iPod with the Windows PC and make sure it's turned on. If it's properly connected, if you go to this PC, your iPod Shuffle will show up as an external device. Another device? Now generally, all the music and other files are hidden. To view them, tap on View, go to Show, and then check Hidden Items. Hopefully you are seeing iPod Control folder, enter it. Now before deleting all contents, if you want to back up the music, just copy the music folder. I'm pasting it in my desktop. Now just straight open your iTunes app. Your iPod Shuffle's name should show up under the devices. If it does, click on the iPod icon. And to hard reset your iPod, from here choose Restore iPod. Now if you get a software update prompt, just select Stop and you'll end up in this pop-up to restore your iPod. Select Restore and wait for the restoration process to complete. When you get this pop-up, press OK. When you end up in this welcome section, that means the restoration is complete. And just press continue and then press get started. Now, if you want to keep using the iPod for yourself, maybe you want to resync all the contents again. But before that, we recommend you to safely eject your iPod and then just manually disconnect your iPod. What you have to do is just turn it off, wait for around 10 seconds and then turn it on again. Connect it back to your charger and reconnect it with your PC again. To resync with all your songs again, open your iTunes, go to Files, to add file to library. Now you can resync with your older songs or any new file if you want. From here, select the file location, enter all the folder one after another, select all, and then add them to your iTunes library. Do the same exact process for the other folders as well. When you're done, either select specific songs or select all from here, right click on it, go to add to device, and then select your iPod Shuffle. Make sure not to disconnect your iPod Shuffle while the copying or syncing process is in progress. And if you check on your iPod list, you'll see all the songs are resynced to your iPod Shuffle once again. And that's how easily you can take backup restore and factory reset, and then resync all the contents and music on your iPod Shuffle fourth generation. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching.